Beats. Jim found out about this job about 45 seconds ago. Run Studio A. Oh, yeah, good, good, good. Dave has worked with Andrew Lloyd Webber, he's worked with Jan Arden, he's worked with Michael Bublé, he's worked on the Macy's Parade, uh, the Olympics. Please welcome Dave Pierce. Brian has achieved great success and he's, he's won a very exclusive club in the world of hockey in that there's not that many people who run hockey teams and he's one of them. I couldn't be more proud or more excited to introduce Mr. Brian Burke. Come on out. He's put us on the world map with Sarah McLaughlin, with Joni Mitchell, Katie Lang, and of course Elton John. John Drummond. John. 40 years ago was his first show when he was 16. Please welcome Tom Phillips. It's a little segment that we call Show and Tell. She has two minutes to show and tell. I don't know what it is, and then we'll just see what happens. So ladies and gentlemen, would you please welcome Mandy Stobo. I do spend more time on the actual commissions that I get than this. <laughs> This is a great set. Tonight's show is about stories. I ask where she's headed, she tells me Ohio. I've not seen my mother in ages. She was in the Olympics! I <laughs> think when I swim in Was there a moment where you looked around and went, oh my god, this is the Olympics? Oh yeah, it was super cool. Men are not afraid of ballet, they're afraid of tights. <laughs> went into the dressing room of Rod Stewart and uh, to meet with him and talk about his music. It was kind of this surreal thing where there was like a puppet of <laughs> Rod Stewart and Rod Stewart getting his hair made and I was just like, this is the weirdest uh, kind of thing that can happen in a day. Dave was way more interesting than I'm gonna be. <laughs> Manny was way more interesting. Then you bring out the goddamn choir. You said you're a player with heart. What does that mean? It means that I'm not afraid to take chances. They say the quality of a work of art is, is directly proportionate to the sacrifice involved, you know, and I think that for all art forms, there's a big sacrifice to make. So talk a bit about concussions in that world. Oh, yeah. You get a, an injury that uh, potentially throws your whole life off, and it's scary. I do a lot of work with Canadian Safe School Network here in Canada. They do wonderful work on lots of safety in schools for students, but the LGBTQ part of it's what makes it important to me. I don't care what Johnny Goudreau says. I just want to hear his voice. I want to go first next time. <laughs> Done. These people have all been told to prepare two truths and a lie about themselves. They choose whether they're going to tell their truth or their lie. I hung out with Sean Penn, Tom Hanks, Barbara Streisand and Jane Fonda. I felt like I was in a wax museum, but everybody was moving. <laughs> I once set up Alex Rodriguez on a blind date. Presenting A World with Jan Arden. Peanut whistle. This might be actually one of my, my best. <laughs> because you know I'm all about that bass, about that bass, no treble. I'm all about that bass, about that bass, no trouble. Thank you guys and thanks again everybody. Thanks very much.